It is a meeting of two northwest rivals and one of the biggest games in English football without any shadow of a doubt. Manchester United against Liverpool coming up here at Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray. Joining me for commentary is Stuart Robson. And Stuart, we're both thoroughly looking forward to this one. Absolutely. And this is one of the great rivalries, Derek. And I think it's fair to say there's not a lot of love between these two clubs. Let's hope we get an entertaining game here. The lineup for Manchester United. Davi De Gea begins in goal. Christian Eriksen plays with Fred in central midfield. And leading the line today is Cristiano Ronaldo. And this is how Liverpool start the game. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander-Arnold in the fullback positions. Thiago starts alongside Fabinho in the centre of midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway. Fabinho. Liverpool have given it away. And Thiago. Fabinho, now the attack fizzled out. Cristiano Ronaldo. And space for the cross. Eriksen, on to Bruno Fernandes. Must take the lead here. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Cristiano Ronaldo putting his body on the line. An awful lot of green space to run into. Thiago. Fabinho. And here's Robertson. Losing possession here. Bruno Fernandes. Now, let's see what they can do here. And a throw-in forthcoming. He could pick out a teammate. Ronaldo. Back for Sancho. Oh, really good reflexes and danger averted. They favoured a short one here. Crossing into the middle. Well, they had a decent reading of that ball in.
Andrew Robertson. And a decent position for Liverpool to be in. Robertson. Here's Salah. Oh, there it is! Liverpool take the lead in the derby. And that has silenced the majority in here. Well, that was a fairly easy finish in the end, but he still had to take it. He won't mind how they come, though. Action underway once more. Let's see if United have the wherewithal to square the game. Bruno Fernandes. Fred. Rashford. Ericsson. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. And a crucial intervention inside the box. Well, Liverpool haven't dominated possession, as you can see. But when they have had it, they've looked so dangerous, particularly when they press high up the field, win the ball back in those areas, and then counter-attack quickly. Fred. Bruno Fernandes has it. Ronaldo feeds it. Bruno Fernandes. Well, here's the replay, and in many ways, it doesn't do justice to how patient they were in the build-up. Just so composed, waiting for the right moment. But there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. So, back underway. One goal apiece here. Fabinho, Nunez, oh that's an interesting pass, well thumped clear, counter-attacking very much an option, not a huge chunk of added time, one minute, space and time for the cross, and tidily played, Cross could be useful, not messing around with that clearance. And that will do it for the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. What a fine first-time performance from Marcus Rashford. I wonder what you made of it. Well, he certainly got his team back into this game with that goal, because up to that point, they hadn't played particularly well. I think he's had a decent first half. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Ericsson. And here is Malassia. Bruno Fernandes. Here is Fred. Cristiano Ronaldo. They might be able to get in now. Ronaldo. Well read to put an end to that attack. Crossing opportunity. The Red Devils have lost the ball. Ronaldo. On to Bruno Fernandes.
just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise, and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. And with play stop, they will make a change now. Underway once more, Manchester United have hit the front. And across the touch line, so a throw in here. And United will switch things around personnel wise. Andrew Robertson. It might be on for them. Not all that convincing defensively. Well, no damage done. Bruno Fernandes. And he read it well. A Liverpool free kick coming up. And opting for the lenient approach, the referee, rather than cautioning him. Time for a change then. Roberto Firmino. A terrific pass. Robertson. A foul it most certainly was. Free kick given. And now to level the game. It's a short corner. Just wanted to get it out of there. Robertson. And it took a touch on the way through. So a corner here. Who's going to get on the end of it? And the no-nonsense clearance. This is Thiago. Here's Firmino. And he's lost custody of the ball here. Terrific block. And Roberto Firmino's in there. Plattered away. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. They need to get tighter. Now he must favour the cross. And giving the ball away. Alexander Arnold. Well, just listen to this atmosphere. It's been such a tight game, but the fans are certainly doing their bit in trying to get them over the finish line. Firmino. Oh, good vision. And pushed onto the woodwork. Well, I thought that was a certain goal. If they do hold on to this lead, the keeper will be getting all the adulation. And nearing full time. United inching ever closer to victory.
Can they hang on? Stuart, your thoughts as regards their performance? Well, for much of this match, they've controlled the tempo of the game and deserved their lead. But this is going to be a frantic finale. They just need to defend their box really well here. Can he finish? And using his body to good effect. And clears the danger. Firmino. And Thiago lost custody of it. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. Could play it in. In position. Oh, a good diving save. If they can score again from this corner, it probably would be the end of the story. Trying to deliver it accurately. No keeper will mind that sort of corner. So full time it is, and a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European campaign. Yeah, that's a good win and a vital three points. Another win next time out, and they'll be in a great position. Well, as you can see, our cameras are not veering very far away from Marcus Rashford. He has every reason to be proud of his own performance. And Stuart, your assessment of it.